Kui doesn't seem to realize how much of a threat I am. Good. I'll get rid of that waste of space in no time. There you are. <laughs> Easy prey. <laughs> <laughs> you must really have a death wish. Coming at me like this? <laughs> You've lost your edge, Vegeta. You don't stand a chance against me with a power level like that. <laughs> don't be disappointed. You're in for a treat. You see, I've managed to learn a little new trick during my time on Earth. <laughs> like what? How to run away? Like how to control my power level. <laughs> no way! 19, 20, 21, 22,000! <laughs> oh. oh. This must be some sort of error, but I sent my scouter to Vegeta's coordinate, and it's showing a reading of more than 22,000. <laughs> Did you say 22,000? That's an older model scouter, isn't it? Here, I'll get a more accurate reading with mine. <laughs> Impossible! It can't be! Is my scouter broken? But it's a newer model! The reading's up to 24,000! <laughs> Are you saying his power level is even beyond ours now? <laughs> Die! We're supposed to be equal in power! You fool! I've grown stronger with each battle that I fought! The most recent one on Earth pushed me to the brink of death! Don't think for a second that a pampered peon like you could ever be my equal! <laughs> 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 Did you say? Vegeta's power level from before! That 24,000 reading, it was real! Oh, I don't believe it! He just took out Kui! I'm hardly surprised at this. How soon you forget, Vegeta is a highly experienced fighter in every right. Not to mention foolish. <laughs> he doesn't seem to know his error in so brazenly defying me. Lord Frieza! The scouter shows there are about ten Namekians in that direction. Very good. Let's hope they have what I'm looking for. The fifth Dragon Ball. Let's pay them a visit. I... I hate to say it, but that's it. We're screwed. There's no way we can ever get back to Earth now. Uh, Bulma? Let's... let's at least get away from this place. We're sitting ducks out here. We should try to find a place to hide. Maybe in a Namekian house or a cave or something. We'll try to figure something out. I'm... I'm sure the Namekians can help us fix our ship, right? I wish I could be as optimistic as you two.
really strong. Buddy, you're in for a real challenge. in a creepy place like that. Huh? Grillin, do you sense that power over there? Uh, yeah, I do. But it's not like the others from before. This time it might be Namekian. Huh? Hide! There's some strange energy headed this way. What are you doing, Bulma? Hide! Those guys we beat up earlier weren't alone! Huh? It's them! Uh... They... They left! Who were they? <sighs> Bulma, d do me a favor and check the dragon radar, please. You said four of the dragon balls were in one spot, right? Well then, it's possible that those guys... Uh, yeah, that explains it. They have the four dragon balls. Yeah, that's what I thought. Go on, did you feel it? Y yeah, their power was incredible. Whoa. That small guy, he he might actually be stronger than Vegeta. Whoa, stronger than Vegeta? No way. Uh, cool, man. Wait, how are we supposed to get the Dragon Balls from those guys? Once Master Roshi learned of the situation on Namek from Bulma, he informed Goku right away. Goku, who was eager to help his friends, then asked Dr. Briefs to build him a spaceship. Dr. Briefs modified the ship Goku arrived in as a child and gave it enough power to reach planet Namek in just six days. After bringing himself back up to fighting condition with some sensu beans, Goku left for Planet Namek. All right, I'm off. I'd better get training with this gravity machine right away. After all, I've only got about six days to get stronger than Vegeta. Hey, you guys! Those creeps from before are heading straight for the Dragon Ball. Uh, hey, that's... Wait a minute. Th that's right back where Krillin thought that the Namekians were approaching us. Okay, I'll head over there and check things out. I'm going to. Uh, wait a second. Huh? Are you just going to leave me here by myself? Well, it'll be a lot safer for you here. Actually, you might be right. Fine. I'll just open up a capsule home here in the cave and wait for you guys. Go on. Make sure you lower your power as much as possible. Right. Frieza's Horrible Henchman. So, you think there are really some Namekian villages here? Well, 
If they are, we need to hurry and find them before it's too late. <laughs> What's going on down there? They look just like Kami and Piccolo. Ah, they must be Namekians! First introductions. I am Frieza. I'm looking for the Dragon Balls. And if I'm not mistaken, I do believe one of them can be found here. We... we don't have anything like that. <laughs> it takes a great deal of courage to lie to me with a power level like yours. Uh, the, that device... That must be how they're able to find what few villages are spread across the planet. Oh, 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 oh. you know, the other elders were all too willing to provide me the information I need. W willing? That's impossible! Well, they did require some convincing. Zabon, show how persuasive we can be. Sir. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> Perhaps you understand now. If you insist on being this difficult, those young ones over there will be the next to die. <clears throat> They're monsters! How terrible! W what do you intend to do with the Dragon Balls? Why, I'll make a wish, of course. Nothing too extravagant, mind you. Just immortality. <sighs> Even if these monsters manage to gather the Dragon Balls, they still might not be able to make their wish. Uh, I suppose we have no choice. But promise me one thing. Promise me you won't lay a hand on the children. Of course. Mind you, you could have saved yourself all this trouble by doing this sooner. Now, take this and be gone. Well, I have you. Perhaps you can tell me something. Say, the location of the two remaining Dragon Balls. If memory serves, you need seven of them to make a wish, isn't that right? Don't be ridiculous. We Namekians are not in the business of endangering our own kind. And just when I thought you were less foolish than the rest, I suppose I have no other recourse but to kill you and the children. Get out of here, Dende! No! Right! No! Our scouters! Now you won't be able to hunt us down anymore! You're all dead! <laughs> it's not much fun killing small fries like you. But you gotta die sooner or later. That's enough! What? what? Who the hell are you? I'm gonna make you pay for what you did! Hey, go on. Uh-oh. 
Gohan has completely lost it! Look at it all! Need to head back to Bulma fast. Hey, can you fly? Oh, uh, um, yes. Th thank you for saving me. So, um, what's your name? I I'm Dende. Hmm. One of Frieza's goons is on the move. This energy. Is that Tadoria? This is perfect. I can more than handle him all by myself. <laughs> Taking on Frieza now would be downright suicidal. <laughs> I have to plan my next moves carefully. Be good. Are you ready to die? Prepare yourself. You actually held your own against the mighty Vegeta!
For starters, I'll make short work of Dodori. Hey there! It's been quite some time, Dodoria. I've waited for you to foolishly leave Frieza aside. Knocking you around should be easy enough without Frieza here. You think you're hot stuff, don't you? Do yourself a favor. Shut up and just hand over that scouter of yours. Do that and I'll let you live just this once. <laughs> Is that so? You went completely radio silent during your attack on the Namekian village. Which can obviously mean only one thing. You've lost every single one of your scouters, haven't you? <laughs> How perfect! Now I can make my way over there unnoticed. You want this, don't you? I guess you're not as dumb as you look, Vegeta. <laughs> <laughs> What are you doing? Why did you break it? You idiot! Don't you realize you're not going to be able to find the Namekians without it? I recently spent some time on a planet called Earth. Believe it or not, they don't require scouters in order to sense power. There was another Saiyan there as well, and he also knew how to use that technique. Which means an elite like myself should easily master it. That's it then, isn't it? Those little runts I was after, they were Earthlings. What are you doing, teaming up with those punks? What? Earthlings? What the hell are you talking about? There's no way Earthlings could be out here. Enough of this nonsense. Stop wasting time and come at me already! I see what's going on here. You've come to realize just how much stronger I've gotten. And now you're too afraid to fight me. You saw my power level on your scouter before. That number wasn't accurate. My scouter was busted. Yeah. What are you so afraid of? Go on, try and attack me! Who do you think you are? You're not better than me! Yes. 
out. Don't underestimate. Prepare yourself. Wait, Vegeta! If you let me go, I'll let you in on a little secret. But it ain't so little. It's a big one. It's about the home of your people. It's about planet Vegeta. What? What is it? Spit it out! You've probably heard all this before. How planet Vegeta was destroyed by some huge meteor, right? But that's not the truth. What happened is a bunch of crazy strong Saiyans like yourself started cropping up all over the place. And the more powerful they got, the more they didn't see the point in following orders from anybody. Lord Frieza lost trust in you guys. And because of that, he felt he needed to lay down the law. And oh, did he. Lord Frieza ended up not just destroying planet Vegeta, but every single Saiyan himself. But you know, Vegeta, you should be grateful. Lord Frieza saw a lot of potential in you, too much to waste. So he made sure to destroy the planet when you weren't there. <laughs> <laughs> I bet that was a lot to take in, huh? You're wrong about that, Dodoria. I couldn't care less about my planet, my comrades, or even my parents. But what infuriates me to no end is how I let myself be used all this time by bastards like you! Thinking about it makes me sick to my stomach! <laughs> You're on freeze! <laughs> Freeze is terrified of the limitless potential of a Saiyan's power. If what I heard on the Scouter is to be believed, then all seven Dragon Balls are needed in order to make a wish come true. First, I'll get my hands on the two remaining Dragon Balls. No, one should be more than sufficient. If I can hide even just one of them, Frieza and his lackeys won't be able to make their wish a reality. Ha! Then all I have to do is wait until their guard is down and steal the rest of them. <sighs> We're finally back. Well, you guys certainly took your time, didn't you? <laughs> uh, took your time. <laughs> huh? Uh, who's the pocket-sized Piccolo? Oh, he's Namekian, isn't he? Y yes My name is Dende. Huh. It looks like you guys have been through a lot. Oh, yeah, that's right! I've got great news from my dad. Really? That's great! Goku's on his way here as we speak. He should arrive in about... Mm, six days. And I hear he's toughening himself up. M my... my dad's coming? Hooray! Yahoo! Six days remained until Goku would arrive on planet Nemec. Goku! Can you hear me, Goku? Wait. Huh? Where are you? Are you in space? Oh, that's right! You're heading to Namek. Good luck finding the Dragon Balls! Wait a minute. You mean you don't know what's going on? There's some crazy stuff going down on Namek. Crazy stuff? Well, we can talk about that later. I've actually got some guests here with me. In fact, it's for people you know quite well. Wait, wait, you don't mean... They've asked me to train them even harder than I trained you. 
Hey, Goku, you hear me? We met up with Kami in the other world, and he told us all about this place. You, you said, said there's, there's four, four of them there, there right? right? So that's Yamcha, Tien... Wait, is Piccolo there too? <laughs> I'm not about to let you be the only one that gets stronger in all of this. Chaozu's here with us too. Kami pulled some strings and let us have our bodies back so we can train here. Pretty cool of him, huh? That's awesome! Glad to hear it! <laughs> I'm doing a bit of training myself on the way to Namek. I had my spaceship customized to simulate 100 times gravity for some extra intense training. But if I don't get stronger in the next five days, I'm gonna be in some pretty big trouble. You mentioned that before. What exactly is going to happen? What? What? Whoa, hold on. You mean there's someone out there that's stronger than Vegeta? Wait, you're not talking about Frieza, are you? Beats me. I didn't hear anything about a Frieza. You know him, King Kai? L listen, Goku. If it's actually Frieza, then stay far away from him. Get on his bad side and you're begging for trouble. I'm telling you, not just for your own safety, but for the safety of Earth, Namek, and every other planet in the universe! Is, is, is he really that strong? I kind of want to meet him now. Do not go anywhere near him! You hear me? I'm looking for some sort of elder. I'm here to retrieve the Dragon Ball. <laughs> Battle for the Dragon Balls. Krillin, did you feel that? Uh, yeah. A bunch of energy just started disappearing. Really? More Namekians are being killed! And the one doing the killing has a very familiar energy. Uh, it's Vegeta! Now it's not just Frieza we gotta worry about wishing for immortality, but Vegeta too! If we can find one of the Dragon Balls and hide it, neither of them will be able to make their wish. But... But they'll just continue killing Namekians until they find all the Dragon Balls! N no! Uh, who are you people? Where did you come from? And how do you know about the Dragon Balls? Please, if you can, save my people! Yeah, about that. Well, if you already know, I think... I think I understand what's going on now. Come on, follow me! I'll take you to see Grand Elder Guru. Huh? Uh... Grand Elder Guru? Why are we headed there? Those monsters that attacked our villages already have four Dragon Balls. Not only that, didn't you say that there are more people being killed over there? Uh, yeah. I think I know who did it. Vegeta. Th their energy... it's all gone. There's no one left. Th then... Then that means there aren't many Namekians left on this planet. Uh, oh, man. Even if we find the Dragon Ball in the village that Vegeta attacked, that still leaves one! Wait, does Grand Elder Guru have the last Dragon Ball? Y yes Not good! If Vegeta reaches him before us, he'll get his hands on the seventh Dragon Ball! We have to hurry and let Guru know! I'll go with Dende. Go on and Bulma, you two wait here. There's no point in all of us going, okay? Right. Be careful, you guys. <laughs> so this must be a Dragon Ball. Fascinating. It must be kept safe. Time to hide it. No one could possibly find it as long as it remains at the bottom of this lake. If it's true that Frieza and his worms have five, that means just one is left out there. <laughs> this power, 
It's Zarbon. I'm sure of it. <laughs> it would appear that he's finally off that leash of his. He'll be joining Dodoria soon enough. In hell. He's close. I'd better eat something. In my current state, Zarbon is no match for me. Useless. about right I fail to see why this is a challenge for some useless about right I fail to see why this is a challenge for some the dragon balls are mine
smiling upon me. Ooh, what is this power? Fortune's finally smiling upon me. We wouldn't have to split up and find the villagers if we just had our scouters. Well, look at that. If it isn't Zarbon. You know, I ran into your friend Dodoria earlier. He's super dead. And soon you will be. What? You beat Dodoria? So that's why he never came back. I can't believe this. I hear you've lost all your precious scouters and had to split up to look for Namekian villages. Which can only mean Frieza's holding on to the Dragon Balls you obtained so far. Damn you. Frieza will not get his dirty hands on all of them. I'll make sure of it. I've already found one myself, and the others are as good as mine. What? As long as I can attain immortality. Good as dead. Ooh. Immortality will be enough to bet the old freezer. Don't underestimate me! Prepare yourself! The battles I fought afforded me some of the greatest power! You still don't feel it, do you? Lord Freezer's power is beyond anything you could ever imagine. After all that, you couldn't lay a finger on me! <laughs> You've improved. I'll give you that much at least. But you don't seem to realize the mistake you've just made. You have awakened my true power. You've got quite a sense of humor. Go on, show me your power! You are going to regret this, Vegeta. Prepare to be amazed by my glorious transformation! <laughs> Damn you! You must feel pretty foolish. You went to all that trouble to grow stronger, and for what? Nothing. And here's something else you probably didn't know. Lord Frieza also hides his true power behind transformations. Oh, he passed out. I'm afraid I can't let you die just yet. I still have a lot to ask you. I can't believe I'm actually providing aid to a traitor like you. Once you're fully conscious, you're going to tell me where you've hidden the Dragon Ball. There it is! That's Guru's house! That's it? Hey, Nail! You're okay! I'm glad to see you're safe, Dende. 
Grand Elder Guru is aware of your situation. You two may enter. Grand Elder Guru will see you now. Uh, he's huge! Welcome, young Earthling. I understand I have you to thank for saving my little Dende here. My gratitude. Uh, well, I really didn't do much. It pains me that most of my children on this planet have fallen victim to such vile invaders. I had no idea the Dragon Balls, the very symbols of Namekian wisdom and power, could cause such strife. <sighs> Forgive me for cutting straight to the chase, but do you think I could borrow the one that you got right there? Look, I won't let the bad guys get their hands on it. I promise! I'd like him to have it as well. If the Earthlings get the Dragon Balls, they can wish for theirs to return to Earth. What? what? There are Dragon Balls on Earth as well. Is or was there a Namekian there? Uh... Yeah. Oh, yeah. I remember hearing about one coming to Earth in order to flee some sort of crisis here on Namek. It must have been Katus, child. Truthfully, I'm surprised the child was able to survive the journey. If memory serves me, he was a gifted member of the Dragon Clan. But how is it he met his end? Did he die of natural causes? Or was he killed? He was killed. By someone here on Namek, a Saiyan named Vegeta. Young Earthling, please step forward. I would like to look into your past. Huh? My past? My, my goodness. He split himself in two to combat the evil in his own heart. How foolish. To reduce such extraordinary potential is such a waste. If he had remained as one, he might not have met with such a horrible fate. Remained as one? Wait, does that mean if Kami and Piccolo rejoin, Piccolo will get his power back? Very well. I can see that your intentions are pure, and that you have exhibited great bravery thus far. I will entrust this Dragon Ball to you. However, you might not be able to make your wish. Uh, what do you mean? Unfortunately, I am not long for this world. I have perhaps only a few days left. Do you think you can reclaim the remaining Dragon Balls from those horrible fiends? As strong as you are, I fear that might prove impossible. Once I am gone, the Dragon Balls will cease to exist. Uh, I see. Well, I guess we'll just have to do what we can. I'll keep the Dragon Ball, and I'll guard it with my life. I appreciate it. I must say, you seem to possess a great deal of strength for an Earthling. But much of it lies dormant and unrealized. How unfortunate. Allow me to release the power resting deep inside you. W what are you talking about? There's no way I'm hiding any more power. I mean, I'm already pushing myself to the limit. <laughs> Where did all this power come from? Yeah! I've never felt this kind of power before. This is incredible! Wait. Uh, would it be okay if I brought a friend of mine here to see you? I bet he's got more untapped power than me hidden inside of him. Yes, please bring him here. We could use another ally in the fight for justice. Uh, okay, I'll be right back with him. Now, wait here, Dende. I'm gonna go get Gohan, okay? Uh, all right, be careful! Hey, Gohan! According to the radar, the Dragon Ball over there is on the move! It's heading straight for us! Do you... do you think it's Krillin on his way back? I bet it is! But... um... What about this one? These five here are probably the ones that Frieza guy has. And hey, here's this one all by its lonesome. Wait, 
That's the village we heard Vegeta was attacking, right? But Vegeta isn't there. I don't sense his energy anywhere near it. Oh, I think I get it. He attacked the village, but he didn't find the Dragon Ball. Let me borrow the radar, Bulma. I'm going to go find that Dragon Ball. Okay, here we go. Hey! Actually... Thank you so much! Perfect. Now's my chance! I'm not sensing any scary energy in the area. That's good. I think I can handle this. Right around here. Oh, this is awful. The village is in ruins. Got to find that Dragon Ball. in a place like that. Maybe the villagers were in a rush to hide it. What? What was that explosion just now? Oh, it can't be. He's not in the recuperation tank. Oh, damn that Vegeta. Where could he be? Find him, Zabon! Find him now! Aha! The Dragon Balls. It looks like five of them are here. And I can't leave this place without all five of them. It looks like time isn't on my side either. Great. I'm going to have to buy myself some time here. There we go. Now it's my turn. No, oh, that filthy Saiyan monkey. Vegeta appears to be after the Dragon Balls. No, oh, the Dragon Balls. <laughs> Damn that Vegeta! This is inexcusable! You will scour this entire planet and find that traitor! If after one hour's time you do not return to me with Vegeta, know that your death will be a slow and painful one! Oh, yes, sir. <laughs> It pains me to say, but it appears Saiyans are capable of more than I initially thought. They seem to grow stronger with each battle they manage to survive. They can't hope to reach my superior level, of course. Still, it might prove prudent to finally rid myself of them once and for all. It would be quite bothersome if I had to deal with a Super Saiyan.
It seems it may be time to call the Ginyu Falls. <laughs> Here they are. Yes, yes, I'm untouchable! This is what you get, Frieza! Your Dragon Balls are finally mine! Now that I have these and the one that I hid underwater, that leaves just one to collect, then I'll have all seven! <gasps> This huge power. Is that Zarbon? This was great! I had no idea I had this kind of power! I bet I can make it back to Gohan in no time at all! Oh man, I bet Gohan's gonna get way stronger than me when he meets Guru! The little runt from Earth! Why is he on Namek? <laughs> and he's holding the very last Dragon Ball as well! <laughs> Seems Fortune is smiling quite favorably on yours truly today! Oh, damn that Vegeta! Where did he go? <sighs> if I don't find him soon, Lord Frieza will have my head! Wait, that... Oh, I've finally found you, Vegeta! Hm. A huge power level is on its way here! I guess Zarbon found me. Good! Once I get that Dragon Ball off the pint sized Earthling, I'll finish him off once and for all! Zarbon's probably quite full of himself after the last encounter.